so in this video I want to show you how to parent objects together so you can move them all together at the same time. So what I mean is if I am in the move tool at the top, this little arrow here, or it's the letter V, same as Photoshop and Illustrator, notice that if I select the car, right, it's separated out from everything else. Same thing with the wheels, and I might even want to come down here to wheel copy, and I can use the arrow keys and shift to move it around. You'll see that they're separated out. But because I want this car to move off the edge of the screen, and I'm going to do Command minus to zoom out a little bit, Command plus, and I can go to this 50% right here and do fit up to 100% just to see it a little bit more clearly. I want to parent all of these elements together so that they're all they all move as one object, but I can still animate them individually. So what I can do is I know that my car front is what I want to attach everything to. That's going to be how I move everything. So then I'm going to start going through and parenting objects to it. So for example, I know that this wheel and this wheel need to be attached to that car. So I take this thing called the pick whip and I drag it to the car itself. And you can also do that by doing the drop down menu for parent over here. And you'll see this car front. Now, when I move it, they all move together with it. You can see I need to do a better job of masking at the top and the bottom. That's okay for right now. So I'm going to undo my movements that I had there. If you don't see this parent menu, that's because you need to do toggle switches and modes. This has the option of showing us. Um, some different settings. So parent actually stays up, but things like the sort of blend modes and track mats, um, those might be hidden. So toggle switches and modes if you don't see it exactly like how mine is set up. The next step is to parent the other objects together. So car back will also be parented to car front. My driver will also be parented to the car front, and I can even do the drop down here and do car front. But left eye and right eye, I'm going to want to parent those to the driver and not the car because I want them to, if I move them around, I want them to be based around the position of the driver. So I'm going to select both of these, holding down shift and selecting both, and drag them to be both with the driver. Now space and satellite are totally separate, so I don't need to animate them or parent them together to the car. So now when I move this car front and I can twirl down the menu here and here to see all of my settings that I can manipulate, the ones that I have right now, this is X position and Y position. X position, if I click and drag, now they're all moving together. All right, in the next video, we're gonna get into basic animation, but this is the basics of how to parent objects together inside a composition.